you have definitely seen those youtubers that talk about glowing up talk about looking better the first thing that comes up to my mind when i see them is bro are you fucking gay he cares more about his appearance than his girl does about hers even if actually do these people have girlfriends bro he does the little thumbnail like this with his fucking cheeks sucked like a fucking fish bro are you fucking stupid are you gay are you fucking gay are you a man or are you gay bro go play some minecraft or something so in this video i'm gonna show you what actually works i'm gonna show you your magic mom formula yes you heard that right your filthy mother mom stands for masculine face attractive appearance and magnetic personality when you think of someone glowing up you don't think about social skills do you that is probably one of the most important stuff you can do if you want to glow up because you can look like a fucking tiktok boy with with like a fucking jawline or something but you can start talking open your mouth to someone and they're gonna see that you're a fucking idiot fucking dickhead same as when there's a pretty girl and whenever she starts talking you see that she's a dickhead and you don't even want to be around her and there are times when it's reversed and it's very unfortunate i could easily give you a two hour lecture on how to improve your social skills how to talk better how to act in certain situations but this is a short video so i don't have time for that instead of that i'm gonna give you two books to read on social skills one of them is one you know how to Win Friends and Influence People by Dale Carnage. Who names this, bro? This is the classic social skills book. Here is basically everything you need to know, so give that a read. But a better alter uh, what? A better alter alternative. A better alternative. Uh, fuck off, bro. What? Why can I say this? Here? A better alternative would be the Charisma Myth by. Olivia Fox Cabane right here and the reason it is better is because charisma is the highest level of social skills this is basically gonna make you magnetic and let me tell you something going around life being magnetic is so much easier because first girls are gonna be fucking hooked on you just because you have this magnetic aura around you getting girls is easy if you have charisma then if you want to be a businessman closing clients is also easier because they are able to trust you because you are charismatic like people with charisma have life on easy mode bro it's so powerful definitely read this book it's a 10 out of 10 book but a very quick piece of advice i can give you is to level up your social skills improve your confidence because confidence is something that everyone looks up to girls love confidence your potential clients love confidence and honestly if i had people around me who weren't confident i wouldn't be talking to them because i want my people around me to be strong confident amazing people like me don't want losers around them right we want amazing people as well around us <laughs> yeah i was not selfish here at all bro question do you know what's the first thing that a person notices about you when you first meet him it's your skin now let me tell you something most youtubers who talk about glowing up and shit give you 50 different products that you need to use because oh you need this for eye bags you need this for this shut up as a man you need only three things first is water like obviously wash your face bitch some of you motherfuckers don't even wash your face and specifically use cold water because that's gonna reduce inflammation redness and puffiness so you don't look like your grandma okay next thing you need is a face wash something that has salicylic acid in it because that reduces acne and shit i'm gonna link some products down below by the way and the third thing is a moisturizer with sun protection and the reason you need to wear sunscreen every day is because when you are 40 you don't want your face to look like your hand when you put it in water for too long like you're all fucking wrinkly and shit nah bro you don't want to look like a fish when choosing products you need to have one thing in mind because everybody's skin type is different you can be dry like a girl it can be normal oily mixed and i think problematic you need to find out which one of these are you and by the way i'm gonna link a product of every skin type in the description so you can choose and don't listen to these motherfuckers who give you 50 products oh this uh, eyebrows i mean this shut the fuck up you know what people are afraid to do the most right now this people are afraid of smiling because their teeth are fucked crooked yellow and for us to improve our teeth so that when we smile at that girl we're gonna blind her with our fucking white teeth 
for us to do that, we need to whiten it. So the next glow up tip is whiten your teeth. And there are only two ways that work. First, if you are really serious about whitening your teeth, invest in some electric toothbrush. Because yes, you can brush your teeth manually, but that shit doesn't work. You don't really scrape the fucking dirt off your teeth. It's as if you were doing leg press versus squats. Obviously, leg press is fucking stupid. Why would you do that? Inferior. You squats. Or when you sit in a Toyota and then you sit in a Ferrari. It's completely different, right? You can feel the difference right away. And then you need a toothbrush that has charcoal in it. This is what I use. It's called Beverly Hills Formula. Perfect white. Looks like this. Yeah, this shit works. And let me tell you something. I was using this, like, for one month and... One of the people in the gym asked me, Bro, do you whiten your teeth because you look so white? And I was like, Yeah, do I? <laughs> and then that girl's gonna ask you, Whoa, What do you do with your teeth? And you're gonna be like, Oh yeah, I brush my teeth twice a day, bitch. Next glow up tip. You have definitely noticed those fuck boys on TikTok who have these... Who do thumbnails like this. <laughs> First thing you have to do. Second, we can do something about this. Do you know what's funny? Back in the time, like your ancestor who was living in caves and hunting food. Hunting food, hunting animals. Hunting animals and he was dependent on his testosterone. He had a higher testosterone than you right now. And our jaws looked completely different. We had these big jaws. We had hunter eyes. Right now our jaws are fucking non-existent. We have long necks. We have fucking prey eyes. But luckily we can do something about this. We can start mewing. What is mewing, bro? What have to do mewing? Simple. You were in the right place. Mewing can completely transform your face. It can transform your jaw, your jawline. It can transform these muscles right here. Your complete structure of your face. It is simply this. You need to put your tongue on the roof of your mouth. Like, the whole tongue. And the simple way to do this, you have to do something that you wish your girl has done more. Let's try to swallow your spit. And after you swallow, wherever your tongue is left, keep it there, keep it there, and try to keep it there for, for as long as you can, ideally for 24 hours a day. That is your correct tongue posture. And if you do this, your jaw will transform drastically. And by the way, this is not like something that will happen over two weeks. Nah, this is a lifestyle. You need to breathe through your nose. Over a certain period of time, you can do those thumbnails. <laughs> Blow up tip number five. Have you ever been to Switzerland on a train station at 3 a.m.? And if you have, have you seen the men that hang out at that time? Mostly homeless men, drunk men. Have you ever, like, been close to them? Or have you been in a men's locker rooms in the gym? Bro, if you haven't guessed it by now, don't smell like shit. Definitely, like, take showers, wash your hair, wash your face. That's, like, normal stuff, but... Invest in some perfumes because having a perfume like people are gonna notice and people are gonna be like Whoa, like most people don't even wear perfumes, bro So if you're gonna be that one guy who does it, you're gonna be different And if you like the perfume you wear, you're gonna ra radiate this confidence that we talked about earlier You're gonna be confident because when you wear a perfume you love you are gonna have confidence wearing it and people are gonna notice I can give you some recommendations, bro. I have like 16 perfumes right now so i know like what's good what's not good i've tested multiple hundreds of perfumes but this comes down to you because you need to love the perfume i'm gonna give you some recommendations though try out this one it's called versace per ohm and this one smells very nice it's very oh my fucking god yeah yeah, 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 yeah. good and let me tell you how perfumes work if you try to impress or get some girls this works like this, you get your fishing pole and you like wait until the fish starts pulling, that's the girl by the way, and you start doing that, yeah, so colognes act like a fishing net for girls. If you by any chance lived in Italy thousands of years ago, you have known that there were these gladiator battles, people were fighting to death bro, and these gladiators had these fucking attractive muscular masculine bodies. And let me tell you, girls around those gladiators were watching them. They were literally drooling as they were watching them. By the way, and obviously, like, it was life or death, so... Yeah, 
It wasn't like that, but in the back of their minds, they were like, oh, this guy is so fucking hot, so attractive. How do you build such a body that women will lust over, drool over? Simple. Jim, I have talked so many times about bodybuilding and weightlifting, so I'm not gonna spend much time here, but going to the gym and building an attractive physique will have that effect because even in clothes, you are gonna look so good. Anything you buy will look so good on you just because you have a good physique. And don't even get me started what will happen when you take those clothes off in front of some girl. Like, on your own fucking danger, bro. On your danger. And our last glow up tip is obviously your style. Because you cannot look like that little boy who his mama is dressing him to school. Nah, you need to look like an attractive man. And let me tell you something, there was a study, I don't remember the name of the study, but they were examining what type of style girls love the most on men. And the style that they came up with was monochrome outfits. And that basically means your outfit is basically one color. It's simple and it's one color. Like not, not big some graphic designs. <sighs> I have a family guy t-shirt. Girls found this the most attractive. And also, building a gladiator body will also help. Here are some examples on monochrome outfits. And by the way, don't let this influence you because you need to feel confident in what you wear. If you wear a fucking coat, look like a grandpa, and you don't feel good in that, people are gonna notice and you will notice because you will feel like shit. So definitely like experiment with this. But as a beginner, I would go simple. Monochrome outfits is a safe bet for you. If you found this video helpful, definitely click subscribe button because you don't wanna miss similar content that's gonna change your life and get you more pussy. Because honestly, like, most people have these problems like most of their lives and I'm giving you information that's gonna fix these problems like for free. So definitely click the button and I'm gonna see you brother in another video. Bye!